Okay, welcome to a new episode of Nate's MMA Corner. I'm Nate, and if you watch my show, you're in my corner. Today's episode is a pre-fight show for UFC Fight Night, Dos Anjos versus Alvarez for the UFC lightweight title of the world. This is going to be a barn burner. Uh, a lot of my friends are picking Eddie Alvarez to win this fight. I don't know what they're thinking. Oh my god, uh, what is the world coming to? I think Eddie Alvarez has a, sh a shot like anyone else, but I think uh, Rafael Dos Anjos gets us done pretty quick. Um, yeah, so there's a pre-fight show of the main card, and uh, yeah, the, this is the main event, and um, I'm picking Rafael Dos Anjos to win first round knockout. I think he comes in explosive. I think this is going to be like the Donald Cerrone fight where he just takes him out within uh, a couple minutes or so. Um, so, uh, I think he's, if this fight goes to rounds four and five, then I think Alvarez has a shot at, uh, winning possibly a decision, but I think Rafael Dos Anjos just wants to get in and get out, and he will do just that. So I'm picking Rafael Dos Anjos, the UFC lightweight champion, to defend his belt against Eddie Alvarez. Then, um... In the co-main event, we got Roy Big Country Nelson versus uh, Derek Lewis, and a lot of you guys know I'm a big Derek Lewis fan, but I'm also a Roy Nelson fan. However, I think Roy Nelson's on his way out, Derek Lewis is in his way up the ladder, and I think this is going to be um, a big win for Derek Lewis. I think he gets it done first round knockout, I think. Um, it's just going to turn into... Um, Roy Nelson looks for that big overhand right, doesn't get it, and then uh, Derek Lewis counters and uh, knocks out Roy Nelson uh, mid to late in the first round. Then, also in the main card, in the uh, welterweight division, we have Alan Joban versus uh, Bilal Mohammed, and I'm picking uh, Alan Joban first round knockout. I think. Alan Joban striking is top notch. I think his experience pays off. I think everyone at Black House uh, trains him well. Good job, Kenny Johnson. Keep up the good work, bro. Love you, man. Um, I'll see you again soon one of these days. Um, and uh, yeah, so Alan Joban takes care of business, and Alan Joban will avoid any ground game with Muhammad, and then he will keep it standing, and keep it standing he will, and he will. Uh, rock and knock out uh, below Muhammad, probably early to mid in the first round. Then, uh, to kick off the main card in the lightweight division, we have Joseph Duffy versus uh, Mitch Clark. Uh, Joseph Duffy, knockout artist, uh, good hands for a lightweight. Um, and I think uh, Mitch Clark is a talented veteran. He's been in the UFC for quite a while. However, I think Joseph Duffy gets it done here, first round knockout. So, there you have it. There's my predictions for this main card, UFC Fight Night, Dos Anjos versus Alvarez. Um, I know a lot of you are shocked I'm picking all first round stoppages. But, hey, you know what, that's that's how I'm calling it. You know, I'm, that's, that's what I'm picking. I'm picking first round knockout or, yeah. All, all these main card fights, and then ironically, a lot of the uh, prelims, almost all the prelims, I got decisions. So we'll see if I'm right, and stay tuned for uh, my next episode, which will be a post-fight for this one, and then also, um, yeah, because it's International Fight Week, there's back-to-back -back -back fights, so I'll be doing a pre-fight show for the Ioana Claudia Gadelia uh, women's strawweight UFC title fight. Um, real soon so stay tuned there's gonna be a lot of new episodes of my show coming so as you all know pre-fight and post-fight for every card so um yeah stay tuned there's a lot of action i'm excited for this one today excited for the next one tomorrow and of course ufc 200 and yes uh john jones is out of ufc 200 i'm well aware um and I will discuss that further in the UFC 200 pre-fight show of mine. So stay tuned for that when that one comes up in the coming days. Until then, see ya!